New tonight, the Department of Homeland Security is extending restrictions on non-essential travel at the U.S.-Mexico border until the end of July. That decision expected to hammer already struggling businesses at the border. Fox 5's Clara Benitez is live in San Ysidro. Clara, you talked with some of those business owners tonight. Jason, that's correct. And the Chamber of Commerce of San Isidro says nearly 200 businesses have actually closed due to those restrictions this past year. Many of them relying on Mexican shoppers, and they say that this extension will hurt them instead of help them. The Department of Homeland Security tweeting to reduce the spread of COVID 19. The U.S. is extending restrictions on non essential travel at our land and ferry crossings with Canada and Mexico through July 21st. Employee of Tepito Club Electronics, Andrea Vargas, says their business has slowed down dramatically since the pandemic began, sometimes only having 10 customers a day. Their hours now reduced because there is just not enough business. Non essential travel restrictions not only affecting mom and pop shops along the border, but big retail too. Customers tend to resell in Mexico, so those are the people who buy it in bulk, and right now we don't have those sellers because they're not um, crossing. Eileen Rivera works at the Las Americas outlets just across the border, recently moving to San Isidro from Tijuana to be closer to work. I used to work at Robert Wayne, uh, but that store closed down just because business was a lot slower. Um, so right now I'm just working at Kate Spade. Rivera believes the restrictions should be lifted. Now the California is back open. It should be now. I know they are allowing to people get vaccinated over there in Mexico. So, I mean, they're vaccinated. I believe that should be enough reason to be able to cross. DHS stating there are positive developments in recent weeks and is participating with other U.S. agencies to identify the conditions under which restrictions may be eased safely and sustainably. Again, those restrictions will be extended until July 21st. This does not apply to United States citizens and only applies to tourists who are trying to come across at a port of entry or through ferries.